Are you guys ready for a new route? Because I decided to begin a brand new route. And do you know why? Because I feel in my old playthrough, even though I was from the game, I was not that good. Uh, leveling up my Pokemon. And now I know the error of my ways. I will really level up my Pokemon to be the best that they ever were. Anyways, that's my beginning of a brand new route. So thank you for understanding why I'm doing this. Anyways, hello everyone, this is Dylan. Kuro Saki here, and welcome to the brand new route in Pokemon Sword. As always, we are going to watch Leon's Expedition Act. With the bright and beautiful fireworks! Let's party! And watch Leon battle to be the best. Welcome one and all to the wonderful world of Pokemon. I will build up gallery then into a wonderful place with thriving nature. Beautiful cities and many Pokemon with great to share our lives. As you know, our society is able to thrive. With these beautiful, wonderful creatures. Thanks to the help from those mysterious creatures that we call Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon are all around us in the sea, in the sky, and even in our town. And those of us who choose to raise and train Pokemon to do battle and compete. We call Pokemon Trainers! Oh, when I'm getting killed away, please allow me to introduce myself. Yes, would you please be very kindly to introduce yourself, the guy who looks like Raspowski. Because guys, here's the thing. This guy looks like Raz Bowski. You may know him from YouTube. And also one of your favorite YouTuber. He looks just like Raz Bowski. My name is Raz Bowski. It's a pleasure to be here. Now, turn your games to together with this greatest Pokemon trainer, the undefeated champion. It's time for Champion Lina's Expedition Max. Guys, we're gonna call him Raz Bowski. Alright, because he looks just like him. So, Raz, shout out to you, my brother. The crowd goes nuts! It's ridiculous or not, Leon, your perceived record is about to end when I beat you here today. You know I don't lose the fighters, Raihan. Charizard! Dynamax! Charizard! Dynamax! Charizard! Dynamax! Look at Charizard! He looks beastly! Pokemon Sword! Let's get it! Oh, what a beautiful Wulu! Trotting around! Being the sheep he is. And there's Hop. And Go in the anime. This must be my house. Oh! We, mu we must be the ones watching Leon's Expedition Max. That makes sense to do, do the whole YouTube thing. We were watching YouTube basically. Hello, hello! Oh, is that your flat new phone, Dylan? We well, want to leave the expedition match on it, but you can't clear him on with your hands full. You know the only way to probably kill him Lee would be his famous Tarzan pose. I wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. Hi, Dylan. 
man, I thank you here tonight, dear. Is this the big day? Yeah, yes, it's like I came running over to get Dylan. Never mind watching the match now. I'm gonna record it at home anyway. I will go to all my brother's matches. What are you doing? So I was making a service recording. Come with me, Dylan. He should be here any minute. And he always brings presents when he visits, so I wouldn't forget that big if I were you. I won't forget, Hop. Don't worry about it, dude, alright? We got this. Okay, I've got a wine. See what mine later. You too, my brother. You too. Get us get off the couch and grab our bag. Oh, nice. Uh, a big, uh, sexy bag. Oh, why? We grabbed our bag. Woo! We look awesome in that hat. All right. Let's see a fancy guy. Let's talk to Mama. Oh, don't you look as sweet. I knew that bag would suit you. Now, hurry along. Harvest waiting, isn't he? Yeah, we can't keep it waiting for too long. Oh, here we go. David, hurry up! Come on, bro! But remember, don't go into the forest, the two of you. What is this? Red Riding Hood? Even though we're wearing red? <laughs> red Riding Dylan! Yeah, a Red Riding Dylan! <laughs> with, a, with a bag and uh, a red shirt. Red Riding Dylan is prepared! Okay, I'll, I'll stop calling myself that. But honestly, though, no. this kind of reminds me of it. Okay, Hop, I get it. We're coming, remember? <laughs> Have a look at you, Dylan. That little bag looks like it would pull you over. And as we know that it should hold anything and leave my brain, even if the biggest is not last. I don't appreciate really making from my bag, bro. My dad gave it to me. Sorry about that. It's alright. But what's a Rudy doing here? Hey! You see the Rulu? I see what you're up to. Look at using tackle on that fancy. Now you listen. We're gonna pass our fence. No! Everyone knows that there's scary Pokemon living in the Super Book field. And uh, yeah, I don't think he gives a flying baloney. Yeah, I don't, he doesn't give a flying baloney. Yes, baloney can, balonies can fly. <gasps> I see a butterfree! I see a butterfree! Dude! That's awesome! Now that's taken care of. How about it, Dylan? Let's race. But I can make it to my house first. What with you lugging up around that big old bag? Stop making fun of me, Hop! We're supposed to be best friends. Jeez. Anyways, we now have to go to Hop's house. It's just done this way. Ah! Oh. He must, uh, train because he has a ring. I can go to the side door. Can I go to the side door? Ah, it'd be a so lot easier if we can go to the side door. Seriously. No, oh, well. Mom, is he here? Thank you at last, Hop. Uh, are you back, Dylan? Hello, dear. Yeah, yeah, but where's Lee? I'm gonna remember I'm gonna call, call her like Harry Potter. He's still not here yet for the hundredth time, honestly, Hop. You must need to lose some patience. He's probably only just arrived at the station in Wreckhurst. Then that's where I'm going. You know, Lee's hopeless with directions like Ash Ketchum, one of my best friends. I'll make sure he doesn't get lost in the way. 
Sounds like Aston. Oh, really you? Yeah, that's probably for the best. You're gonna come with them, man. You still never met my big bro, right? I'm gonna miss out on the chance to meet the undefeated champion. I'll wait for you on the roof. So yeah, Harp is actually from the uh, Pocket Monsters anime. His name of Pocket Monsters was Go, and he was partnered with Ash. So I wonder if this is a prequel to Harp and Go. See, he never, because he hasn't met Ash yet. So yeah, that's a good question. Is this a prequel to Pocket Monsters? Because if if it is, they could really add their escape to the anime. As like a prequel to Hop. Go. Let's gonna move on. All I remember the land, my Pokemon could come out of nowhere if you walk into the patch of the tall grass. I got my wood with me, so I'm ready for battles against my Pokemon of course. But not you, dear land. We're still clear from the tall grass as we go. Oh come on! Come on! Hop! Come on, dude! I just want to get the Pokemon! No, I want to see the tall grass for you! You got no Pokemon of your own, mate! But I want to get into the tall grass! Come on, dude! You're gonna help me! Yeah, I know! I know! But no one is in the tall grass for you! You got no Pokemon of your own, mate! Come on! Alright, alright! Please. Please. No, why do you get the tall grass for you? If you get no Pokemon of your own mate, I see you over there. Oh! Uh, okay, never mind. <laughs> Alright, we're in Red Coast. This music sounds like Persona 5. Somehow. Ah! The famous toys are posed, and the crowd goes wild. They go nuts. Because they love you, Leon. And we love you too, mate. Hello, hello, Wreckers. Yeah, can be a Leon this back. I promise I'll keep doing my best to deliver the greatest battles for you all to watch. It's our unbeatable champion, Leon, you and tell us about the greatest. Well, thank you for that. Yeah, I know they look alike. Hop and Leon look alike. That, I, I know that's not from anywhere. From Leon. I hope you all carry on swinging up your Pokemon and never stop from battle. Okay, that's good to know. Thanks, Leon. Then come to tell us me with the champion title. We're on it! We've got... Working on our battle skills. Looks like you tell us to leave. But that tells all of you that it's too strong for the likes of us to take on. Too true. That tells all this place to be strong. But all the Pokemon can be strong as well. And that's why you want the strongest of challengers. To feel the damn challenge that come battle me. My wish is for Gaius friends to work together to become the strongest in all the world. Lee! Ha! So my number one friend in all the world has Come on, I was ready to pick me up. Look at your hop. I'm breaking it wrong. It's like an inch in a quarter since the last time I saw you. Bingo! That's a sort of cup I just kept you under feet for so long daily. And these bright eyes over here. I've got it. You must be Dylan, am I right? I've heard loads about you from my little brother. I'm Galo Regent's greatest ever Pokemon champion and massive Star Star fan too. You will call me down to be with Leon. Come on, Lee, and you, Dylan. I'm going to beat you both back home. Dad Hop. Always wanted to be the best, isn't he? 
When the bubble rival of his own, I bet he put himself to become something extremely special. Well, everyone, I bid you farewell for today. But don't you fret. I'll always be around to make sure everyone in Gala has a champion time. Alright, let's head home. We're running home like it's no tomorrow. Running home like it's the Pokemon world that we want to live on. Come on, Lee, you promised us a present, so out with it. You brought them in, and me, Pokemon, you did, didn't you? I know you must have. Right then, the greatest gift from the greatest champion. It's story time, everyone. Alright, so this is the point where we get our starter Pokemon. And, alright, take a good look, you two. The grass type Pokemon Grookey, the fire type Pokemon Skull Bunny, and the weather type Pokemon Soulball. So, like always, guys, I always go for the middle one because it's always the main Pokemon, like Pikachu wise, and like um Charmander wise. So, I'm gonna be picking a uh, Skull Bunny again. Plus, I'm a big Skull Bunny fan. And in Japanese, the same as, uh, Sepani. Or he bunny. I like him. Oh, I, I love everyone. Yep, he's the middle. Where's the you shoes? And he even looks like me, too, so I like that. Alright. And you know who I'm gonna pick. Already, Skull Bunny. Go on, you pick first. I think I'm a ruler after all. That means you don't really need a starter. You got a ruler, dude. Uh. Ooh, ooh. Gotta make sure I get it. Skull Bunny. Skull Bunny is fighter type. It's fearless burst. It's fearless to burst in with fiery passion. You know what's that on the fire type Pokemon Skull Bunny? Yes! That's why I like fire Pokemon. Because of the fiery passion. And I like that. And with their passion, we're bond more. And that's good. We don't need to give him a nickname. Because I like the original names, as always. Props, dude! Ha! So it'll be score button for you. Nice one. Then I go with Grookey, you're mine. And I'm gonna beat you because grass is actually weak to fire. I'm aiming to be the next champion, so be ready. You know we're doing some serious training. Ah yes, I'll be doing that too. We're doing some serious grinding and training on this adventure, guys. And you'll be all be witnessing it. With me. I bet you will be hop. That's why I buy a lot of these Pokemon for you and Dylan. So the two of you can battle and win and grow stronger together to try to reach me. And you'll come with me. Those so are returning the ropes. He's great but real strong and real kind too. Alright. I know with all this winning nonsense for one night. <clears throat> Then there's when the children, we no longer poke one and it's all eat. Ooh, kebabs! Awesome! I love kebabs. And we're just standing there like a champion. <laughs> and hop is! Hop it! With those, uh... <laughs> with those foods! <laughs> oh, hop. The next day. You spend the whole night with a new partner of yours, right, Hop? You two will get on a right, understand one another. Maybe even build up a bit of love. Of course I have, Lee. This is Mr. Fast Fan with the Skull Bunny, too. 
But this is not the experience, but living there's seven the Pokemon. If it was the Wind and Island killing on the island side by side and long enough, then someday you might even become worthy robbers for me, the unbeatable champion. Why are you looking at him for me? I'm the one to be coming to challenge you. If you think Dylan might be able to challenge you, then I guess he's my first rival. Uh, but I'm not planning to lose to him and mess on my chance to be the unbeatable champion. Let's have the Pokemon with you doesn't make you a good trainer, you know. Public trainers raise the Pokemon to be up to first training battle too. Oh, you think you're worthy of calling yourself a public trainer already, Hop? Yes, I'll be the judge of that. Let's see how you handle yourself in battle against your friend if it's up for it. What do you say, willing and ready to take Hop on the on your first ever Pokemon battle of your life? Yeah, let's do it. Believe in your pun of Pokemon, Dylan, and take care of them too with all your heart. You don't see it in that. I'm certain you'll to choose the moves that suit your Pokemon. And more importantly, you have a champion time battling with them. And I'm gonna do that, because I'm happy that I got a Pokemon with me. Looks like everyone is on board. Pokemon and things alike. Then let's do this. I would everybody's knees ever had. I would every bugger man gets in here that I would have back at home too. I know exactly what you're doing in order to win. Me too, actually. Because I play Pokemon as a kid. So let's do this, Hop. And I will beat you. Okay, so send out his Voodoo. I feel like we only have Taco since he's a level 1 or something. I'll put my brother this and I've got my partners with me. Yeah. It takes out a good fair amount of damage, so that's good. We're not gonna attack her though. We're gonna keep tackling. Because we don't have that many moves yet, and we're gonna like be this brutal. And we beat this brutal. Perfect, okay. That was easy enough. I need to use a potion if I have one. Oh wow, level 6. And we learned Amber, good. So I don't yeah, I added another plus the ally to my team. Well, actually, I'm not risk it. Yeah. Because now we have another attack, Amber. And I know my time spell and levels. You really know about the type of thing it is. I'm pretty sure we'll win. Actually. Tackle. I'm pretty sure we're gonna win this. I'm pretty sure. If we just should keep doing tackle. Yeah, we won. Good job, Go Bunny. I was uh, kind of worried I was going to lose then. Because I was pretty low on health. But I'm so glad we won. And we could have level 7. Good job, Go Bunny. Alright, good. We won. You beat my two Pokemon with your one. You win that Go Bunny at 2 max. And we got $400. Thank you. Hop, I appreciate your respect. But that was a shock. Because I know Riley thought he would give you a Pokemon too. You and the Pokemon all fall hard. Maybe you almost wanted to let us all out and join in on the other fun. Good effort out there, Skull Bunny. Why not I get you all sorted? And Dylan, you've got real promise. In fact, I've got a favor to ask you. Be a real rabbit to hop with you. Push him and make him. Push him and make the both of you stronger. I really want to get stronger and stronger. You see me better now, Lee. So come on, you've got to let me take on the Pokemon exams. You don't exam challenge? Anything you want to do for the great, single greatest competition in the Gala region? No, I put on the cup before the rubber that's still a little brother. And that's really what you want to do. You need to have a whole lot you need to know about Pokemon. Especially your friend Dylan, before you think about getting a gym bag. Best to think about getting a Pokedex. 
And so this movie that helps them learn lots of things about Pokemon out there, including their strengths. And it's one of the collection of data, you know. It's a record of a trainer's love and passion for Pokemon training. Right, 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 we get it. Pokedex is still more on it. It looks like it's out of the Pokemon Research Lab for you and me, Dylan. That's the kind of enthusiasm a trainer needs. I'd like the professor know to expect you. I'm going to be the next champion, so complaining as if my Pokedex will be nothing. There's another page in the of my legend. You'd probably better go and tell your mommy that we're heading out though. Huh? What's going on? Dylan, did you hear that just now? Yeah, I did. What's going on? The gate's open! And the room that was there. Oh no! Oh, that poor Lulu! Oh my god! We have to save it. We have to save it. It was second in the fence pretty hard earlier. You don't think you actually broke through there, do you? But it's off limits. Your body's supposed to go in there. I remember the professor's granddaughter went in once and she came back in the real state. But that was nothing compared to the year for that she got from the professor afterward. Yellen, what do you say? We have to save it! Right, even if we're not supposed to. This is the kind of scene where you simply have to do the right thing. Hope you're waiting for anything because we're going to end there, man. Oh, I am waiting for anything. We're gonna come. Yeah, no, I, I know, I know, I'm coming. When it comes to Pokemon. When it comes to Pokemon. I vow to save their lives. It's the right thing to do. That yeah, will do. What do you think it went off to? The fog is coming in thick now. If we find that Pokemon if we don't find that Pokemon soon, this might be trouble. Yeah, no, that's true. That's true. We've got to save Wulu. Hmm? Oh my, this is a Scrovex. Now all I want to do is battle to turn up Skull Bunny. Growl. We're going to growl first to lower its defense. It doesn't take that much damage. Good. Now tackle. Wow, that's a good amount of damage. And the reason I don't want to catch these Pokemon is because they're really low level. They're like at level 2. And Ember. It's actually good to um do different attacks. So that way your Pokemon levels up and gets experience. Yeah, Scorpion is fine, so we can continue over the bridge and into the next grass field. Alright, this is the Rookie D. I actually want Rookie D, but later on. And you'll see why. On the veil. Oh. Okay, well, load the lower its defense. Perfect. All right, yeah, that's similar to Growl. He's just giving us a look. Tackle. Good job. He's giving us another look. Where are you, Mr. Bean? And Ember. Perfect. See, we're leveling up like really fast as we're doing different attacks. And that's a good thing. Whoa! Did you hear that? Was that the Pokemon crying out, you think? Yeah, definitely! 
That was definitely a Pokemon. But it's it could be rare, I'm not sure. I think it is rare. Same thing. Growl. The lowest defense. An attack. Then tackle. And ooh. Okay, we may want to um grab one more time and then amber. Because she's not even attacking, so we're going well again. And I think she's going to. Oh, tell her, but I thought he was going to tackle. And then amber. He held on! He actually held on, so we're gonna tackle that. Oh. That doesn't surprise me that it held on. That wouldn't surprise me. Am I still recording? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we got some good experience. We're gonna probably level up to level 8 soon. Come on, Dylan, that wouldn't remind me in real trouble. Yeah, I know it could be. Oh, the poor Wulu. We're definitely gonna save them. Because I care about all Pokemon. Because I love Pokemon. The one Wulu, we're coming. This is mad. I can't even see my own hand in front of my face. I think I, get, I know why this place was off limits. Yeah, no duh. It's probably dangerous. Hope the big bad wolf doesn't come out. I uh, well, uh, it's not a wolf, but uh, <laughs> it's something. One and the. Lord. Huh. It looks rare, so it might be a rare Pokemon. Growl. Let's see if that affects it. doesn't even affect it. Whoa! Wow! The move had no effect on it. Yeah! Let's try tackling. It went right through him! Like... It's some sort of ghost Pokemon. Dylan, I can't see anything. You okay? Uh, Amber, do you like to play up a bit? Because we can't see. Amber, what? Whoa! Wow! That's bright. I can't see anything. Oh man. Oh good golly. Hop, Dylan. What? Lee, how do you manage to find the way here? Your parents are directions. The roads get lost. Oh, that's nice to hear from the little brother who had me worried sick. I've been bringing English for you two, and you two never show. Of course, I keep looking for the both of you. Wait, where's the Wulu? We were trying to save the Wulu. Oh, good, it's safe. Yeah, the little chap starts fine. So you all have fainted by the time I found you here. You know this place is out of bounds. But it took courage to come in here the same. And I understand well enough why you did it. You did good, Hop. And at least you believe it's alright. Yeah, Dylan? 
I thought we had it when the real fog started rolling in and then my Pokemon attacked. But at least it wasn't worse for nothing. Attack by some mad Pokemon. What are you talking about, Hop? It seems a little stronger than any Pokemon I've ever seen. And it had some sort of presence. I almost didn't even touch it. I mean, really. It seemed to pass right through it. You moves right past through it. There's a few some Pokemon that say they live in the summer book real. And are they actually illusions or something? That's wrong enough. Maybe the two of you could be the ones who reveal the truth someday. Well, now let's see if we get out of this place. You'll be alright now that I'm here with you. And if you it from me, what an experience! This will make a pretty fine first page in the Tell My Legend. So we're going to take all of off the records now. They must bear with you without a word. If it was to leave us there. Alright guys, I'm in it right here. I hope you enjoyed the first part of Pokemon Sword. And if you want to see more, let me know by asking for blasting that like button. And keep relaxing, relaxing, and don't stop believing. And I will see you guys in the next episode. And most of all, I love all of you.